Erasmus Max. I work here at Swinburne University, but soon I'll come to you and help you with your smartphone filmmaking projects. I make films on smartphones for NGOs, community groups, short films, city films, documentaries, and yeah, check them out. Oh, info's right below here. What we'll do is we'll talk about storytelling, ideation, how to come up with a good story for your project, whether it's a science project, a short film, or a social media project. Introductory is a workshop, so we can only talk about the very basic principles, but we will cover framing, um, composition, and of course a bit of rhythm and pacing for editing. One that we'll consider as audio, because we want to make sure your project sounds good. And so I'm using a microphone right here and headphones. Um, we all think about music, which music you can use, create a state of commons, so that when you upload your projects, everything is well sounded. Because you can forget things in a hurry. Of course, one of my favorite apps for filming is Filmic Pro. You can control focus, exposure, white balance, which is quite key. So here, sitting in an environment with different lighting conditions, you can see the lights behind me, there's a massive window in front of me. So we've got two different light sources and you can change the color balance, so it's a quite amazing app. Yes, and if you want to, you could even do green screen by being in a green environment with lots of good light. Let me just adjust this a bit and see what we can do. The great thing with smartphone filmmaking is that you can edit anywhere. Um, so, using some apps like Splice or Luma Touch, depending on what you need to achieve with your project, and then we'll upload them. So, we don't really need a uh, Mac or PC, but of course, if you're keen to produce a longer project, so anything that's about two minutes, um, I think it can be useful to use a, a Mac or a PC as you wish. So, cause you can of course use the smartphone these days to produce feature length films. Okay. I think it's time for me to go and pack. I'll also put a few things in my hand luggage, like just the beast grip or some XLR microphones and XLR connectors. So you can see that you can use your smartphone for quite a sort of high-end production in terms of achieving broadcasting quality or producing things that you can put into film festivals. Yes, talking about film festivals, um, every year I create the MENA International Mobile Innovation Screening Program. And so yes, I hope that we will see your productions on the big screen soon. Your projects to Vimeo or YouTube or a server of your choice and how to disseminate this through available social media channels, so whether that's Twitter, Facebook, and where to find filmmakers online, smartphone filmmakers, so that you can you know, discuss and share and get inspired by other people's work. Okay. I think I have to get going now and pack my bag and looking forward to meet you soon.